Hi everybody, welcome back to another episode of Jessica Drives, where I'm driving home from work. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I love getting done at 4.30 now. It's a lot more fun. I am able to get a little more done at night, not much. Um, but it is nice. And I'm gonna take a different way to go um, out of here today, because I don't want to go that way. So, but um, yeah, so I've had a good day. Um, so my blood work appointment for tomorrow has officially been canceled. Uh, once again, courtesy of my insurance company. Uh, well, mostly because of my insurance. So, yay! I love health partners. They are the worst insurance I could ever have. And I'm never going to deny that. They are the worst insurance you could ever have in your life. And you're asking why I know that. Because this is the second time I've had this happen. Uh, because apparently the labs that I go to are not networked with them, which sucks and pisses me off. And I was like, well, they're not networked, and why are they on your system as a network? Oh, no, they're not networked with your insurance. So, great. Let's see what happens. But, uh, yay. I need my coat down. I don't want to hear that rattling the whole ride home. My coat's got metal buttons on it, and it, well, my jacket has metal buttons on it, and it vibrates. I had to use it this morning because it was cold, but now it's warm. Like, warm. The beauty is warm. Um, now it's like 87 degrees out here. What the hell? It's been freaking April for freaking April in the last. It's 87 degrees. Holy hell. April. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm all for that. I'm all for 80 degrees in April. Hell, I'm all for that. Uh,. If I had a job that I could wear shorts, I would uh, be like, yeah, let's do this. But uh, I can't wear shorts at my job, unfortunately. So that sucks to be me. But I can wear skirts and leggings, which, uh, <laughs> which believe me, I'm going to be uh, probably doing come summertime because uh, I know how hot it gets around here in summertime. It is not pleasant. The heat of this place is unbearable. We pretty much are like one step away from um, dry humping the sun. Honestly, I mean, I know it gets like warm in other places like Hawaii, Jamaica, places like that. Yeah. Um, you guys come to PA. Like, come to the southeastern part of PA. I guarantee you, you will be, uh, you'll be cooking in the sun. I mean, you'll be cooking in the sun. No argument here, but. Yeah. Anyway, so my appointment was canceled. So now I had, uh, at least the lady though was very nice and told me where I had to go. I have no choice in the matter of what to go there. So I have to use Quest, which is a um, off-site laboratory thing. And I hate them. But uh, I have no choice in the matter. I have to use them because they're the only ones that will take my insurance. These poor pricks. Um, I did, last time I went to my doctor's office and got it done, but I guess I can't do that again this time. Been nice if I could have just did that again, but of course not. No, last time was probably a one time off exception because it was I didn't know where else to go and I think everything was still new and it just got bought out. So, you know, gotta love insurance, giant waste of money. Mine's free happily, mine's through the state, but still. And somebody's out there wondering how the hell are you getting it for free because I'm poor. Um, I just have to let them know that I have a new job, which I do, but right now I'm in the 90 day probation, so I have no insurance. Um, if I were to lose my coverage, then I have zero insurance. So since I technically do not have any insurance because I have no insurance, I can keep them. And there are some other girls at the office that have um, the same insurance that I do. So we are all in the same boat. So they're the ones that were like, oh, no, you, you can't. Nope, you can just let them know, hey. Because, um, honestly, we're all in the same boat. <laughs> so, like, they told me exactly what to do, and I have been doing that. But yay! So now my blood works Thursday morning instead of Tuesday. And I have to go to a um, whole different place, which sucks. I hate that. Oh, well. You live and learn, then you get lots. I don't know, 
those some old stupid cyber commercials. You live, learn, then you get loved. Um, yes, yeah, so I've had a good day. Um, I miss talking to my coworkers so damn much right now. Um, it is so miserable and boring at my desk. I um, actually start to fade, start to doze off if I'm not careful. Uh, take into a little bit of yoga, mostly one to help my lower back, and two, um, well, keep me awake. <laughs> There's that too. Keep me fuck awake. Um, but yeah, so it's boring now at work. It's still fun. I still like my job. I could sit in front of a computer all day long. If I was doing Twitch, it'd be even better, but <laughs> I'm not doing Twitch yet. Uh, speaking of which, I am going to try to um, stream on Twitch. Apparently, you can with the app. I'm going to try. Uh, keep raising that sentence. Um, again, to see if it works or not. Let everybody know hey, I'm going to be live on Twitch for like a little while. In case you guys want to come by, you know, shoot the shit, say hi. I'm not going to be playing nothing, obviously, because I'm on my tablet. But I can at least stop by, say hi. You know, stop by, say hi, Jessica. How you doing? Big fan of your channel on YouTube. Um, I'll let everybody know when I do that, though. So keep an eye on my like um, Twitter feed, and I'll let you know when I'm doing that. I crack the door here a little bit. It's getting warm. But again, yeah, I mean, it's like 80 something degrees, and I don't have AC in this. I have to fix the AC in this car. Um, why don't I have AC in this car? Because I'm sitting through Mr. Ringless with the window. Uh, for you know, We've had this car since 2017, and we've never had working air conditioning. We don't even have working defrost in it. It barely works. Yeah. I'm not even joking. It barely works in this car. Go figure. Um, yeah, so I'm on my way home. I have a nice dinner waiting for me, and I have some wheat thins waiting for me after dinner. It's a nice snack. That I wasn't sure I was going to get to eat uh, because of my appointment being tomorrow morning. But, uh, yay! Uh, because my appointment got canceled for tomorrow and it's now Thursday with the different place. Um, I can eat my wheat thins. I can eat my snack. Which I eat. Makes me happy. Also, some Skittles because I have a sweet tooth. So I suppose some Skittles will help me out. I saw some Skittles. I bought a bag of Skittles, like a big bag of Skittles. I like Skittles. That doesn't show. I love Skittles. I've always loved Skittles. I like the lime. You cannot give me that green apple crap. Lime. It is lime Skittles. That is the best. No green apple crapple. It's lime Skittles. Those are the best of the lime Skittles. If it ain't lime, then they're lying because it's the green, the green apples sucked. I ate them, but I never liked them. Although, if anybody wants to hear like a really good story, I did buy a bag of Skittles once. Scored me, a free, I bought a bag of Skittles that scored me a free bag of jelly beans. So, what happened was, and let me try and get over here if I can. Okay, um, so what happened was this. I bought a bag of Skittles, just a small little pack of Skittles, and I was like, okay, you know, it's a simple bag of Skittles, nothing too elaborate. And I open it up, and they're all lemon. They're all the yellow Skittles. And I'm just like, okay, how in the hell did I get all yellow Skittles? So. I sent a message to uh, the main company that uh, manufactures them, and I'm like, "Is there like a contest or something that you know if you find the bag of yellow Skittles you win?" I said, "Because I found the bag of yellow Skittles, what do I win?" And they're just like, "There is no contest. There's no like really like yeah no there's there's no contest." I'm like, oh. So I got a coupon for two dollars off. And I took that coupon and went, because it was good on any of their products. They had the list of what products. So at the grocery store that we went to at the time, this would have been in 2015. That was when all hell broke loose that year. Uh, it was the year my grandmother died. It was the year um, my mom's car kind of took its last breath of life, which 
I spoke cry about it. I missed that. I missed that old sable. That old sable and I went. That old sable and I saw some shit. <laughs> that old sable and I saw. We were, we went through some shit. Um. But the car was giving us some issues. And the grocery store that was right up the street from us, or right, well, that we go to, um, up the street from the laundromat we go to. And I was like, I'm going to walk up. I'm going to get me a bag of scope. I'm going to get me this bag of jelly beans. It was $2.39 for the jelly beans. No tax on it because it's food. And this store, uh, the, this store was very good about that. Except for tea and certain beverages, they did not charge tax for food, which is really good. Um... And I bought a $2.39 bag of jelly beans for 39 cents. That was the cheapest bag of jelly beans I ever bought in my life. And by God, were they not the sweetest jelly beans I ever had in my life. I love those jelly beans. The Starburst jelly beans, I, they are my favorites. So there you go. If anybody wants to know something about me, here's your uh, Jessica trivia for this drive home. Uh, I love Skittles. I love Starburst jelly beans. I can tolerate Starburst. I like them. But when I found out that they make jelly beans, I was just like in seventh heaven at that point. Like, you know what? I'll take, I'll, I'll take jelly beans. I'll take Starburst jelly beans. I will eat Peeps around the holidays. I love Oreos. Um, to be specific, I love the orange fill Oreos that come out of Halloween. I will purposely go out of my way. I will violate my diet. Like any diet I'm on, I will violate the hell out of it for a pack of orange Oreos. I will eat those. Those are my favorites. I did like the spring ones that they had a couple times. Um, it was like blue and yellow. And then they got rid of those. They stopped making them. I was like, damn it. Uh, but I love the Halloween Oreos. I actually got some last year. I was very happy about that. I was able to get my hands on some last year. Because I didn't think they were going to have any. And then all of a sudden, I'm like, oh my god, they have them. And I grabbed one. Like, when I saw it, I think it was, like, near the end of August, I saw it. And I was like, mine? <laughs> like, I, I literally grabbed it, chucked it in my car. I'm like, I will buy it an extra five bucks if I have to, to you know, to buy you. Because, I mean, that was well worth it. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so there was that, but yeah, I bought a bag of Skittles that got me a free bag of jelly beans, so go figure on that one. Yeah. Never really know, right? It's ironic with some of the fun things in life will get you if you're not careful. But, yeah. Anyway, though, guys, I am on my way home, so yay. I gotta figure out something to do, though, with my videos, like topics and stuff like that to do, but nobody's giving me any answers or any ideas or any thoughts. You know, guys, let me know what you want to see me do on this channel. I, I just can't keep doing, you know, the same old, same old if it isn't going to work. I mean, the video game stuff, I don't get that many views. I get a lot of views for my Jessica Drives videos and stuff like that, but when it comes to my gameplay videos, I mean, I guess it's because I'm not playing newer games, but I don't have a way to play newer games. Like, I can't play new shit. I gotta play retro stuff, you know? Emulations. If I can get an emulator. But, I mean, that's what it is, guys. But, anyway, I'm probably gonna play some Pokemon tonight. I gotta finish that. I gotta finish up Sapphire so I can go catch Latias. I got, I got to go catch Latias. I want to catch that one, but and I still have um, my goal of trying to get a 3DS, which I swear to God, if my friend Jill has one of those, I am gonna bum that off. The, I'm gonna bum the hell out of that off her. I already bummed a SP off her so I could test those cartridges. Oh, by the way, they all work. Um, the Tetris one will not hold a save. That's the only one. Um, so, and this is something that I did not know, and I kind of wish they would have, uh, put out there for everybody. With Pokemon, um, Crystal, and apparently the other 
um, 2 from Gen 1. So basically any of the Gen 1 games and the ones from Gen 2. If you hit new game, it auto clears whatever you had saved. It's done. It doesn't even give you the option of like, hey, are you sure you want to do this? Because I accidentally, I tested it out. I'm like, okay. So like, oh, it did save. Then I tried a little bit. Okay. So you have to be like a little ways into the game. Okay. It works. I'm like, yay, it holds a save. Woohoo, battery still works. It makes it worth a little more. And then I'm like, let me, you know, double check this. I was going to clear it out. And I'm like, huh. Hit new game and it just completely wipes it. So like there's no way to, yeah. Usually with other, with like Gen 3 and that, which is where I started, um, you can hit new game. It won't clear shit until you actually get to the point when you save. When you hit that save button, then it says there's, you know, already data on here from a previous game. Would you like to override it? That's when you say yes or no. I was like, before that, I'm not seeing him say it. I was like, oh, well, holy hell. So that kind of sucks. But, um, yeah, so for those of you out there that were wondering about Gen uh, 1 or 2 games, there's something new that I learned, is that if you hit new game, you can technically wipe the game. Very good. Very cool to know. I kind of wish I would have known that beforehand, but oh well, it's cool to know. But yeah, I still have to try to get, um, I legit have to try to get my, uh, Pokemon games. I want to try to figure out a way to get my Pokemon off of my, uh, white game onto my computer as like a backup file so I can have my Pokemon for eternity. I love those guys. They're my favorites. We've been through so much together. Like a whole lot together. The Mana P that I got when they uh, did the Toys R Us release, I went to Toys R Us. I stood in line for that. I had to lie to people and say that I was getting it for my kid because I was still Andrew then. And they're like, well, why is this uh, six foot two guy standing here? It's something for kids. And the one employee is literally looking at me like, are you sure you're here legitimately, sir? And it's like, yes, I am. And I've explained the whole thing. I had to lie and say that I'm getting it for my kid. Today's his birthday. My wife's taking him. My wife took him to some place that he wanted to go. I said I had to work. And unbeknownst to him, I'm coming here and getting this for him. Okay, carry on. I'm like, what the hell do you guys care? At least I wasn't being the creepy guy that was literally trying to trade with every Tom, Dick, and Harry every like two seconds. You guys want to trade? You guys want to trade? You guys want to trade? I'm like, I was one of the like first six people there for that thing. And then they finally had a standing outside of the gaming area because they got tired of us just sitting in there. Like, okay, you all need to go outside. We're tired of having you in here. I'm like, yeah, you jerks, but whatever. I got the, whatever. I got Manaphy. Leveled Manaphy up to level 100. Gave Manaphy the best stats I could. Trained Manaphy to be very strong. Gave the best moveset I could think of, and I love it. One of my favorites. Okay, I cracked this window. I'm getting hot again. You know, I'm looking forward, like I said, when I get my boob job, because these forms do massively attract heat. That is the one sad part. They are heat magnets. They are massive heat magnets. I mean, oh, they are heat magnets. Oh my god, are they heat magnets? I don't mind it, but oh good lord, they're heat magnets. Oh, I want my boot job so bad. But, yep. Yeah. Yeah, I have to have the window open, guys, so you're going to be hearing car noises now. Because <laughs> it is so hot in this car. I don't have working AC. I gotta fix that. I've got to get AC for this car. Summertime's going to be a bitch without it. 
if we're getting a taste of what summer's gonna be like today, holy hell. I'm screwed. Okay, but yeah, so I'm on my way home. I have a nice dinner waiting for me. Mom's making some nice dinner tonight. And I'm going to basically uh, get to enjoy it. And I got my snack for tonight. I got some meat guns to eat. I'm looking forward to that. And I got some skills I can have. Satisfy my sweet, my sweet tooth. And I just have to remember to not take my medication Thursday morning instead of tomorrow morning. I love insurance, don't you? So much fun. All right, guys, I'm almost home. So I think I'm going to cut this one. It's like the second 20 minute video of the day. So enjoy it, guys. It's a beautiful day out. If you get a chance, or, sorry, well, until this goes up, the day will pretty much be over. Um, but if you had a chance to go out today and you enjoyed it, congratulations. It was well worth it. If you didn't, okay. it's okay. It's always less time. Anyway, though, guys, I am done for now. I will catch you all in the next episode. Bye.